Hey everybody, so I hope you had a really really good week and I'm super excited to be filming today But yeah, I'm gonna finish this whole entire collection series off with a whole entire makeup collection video That's gonna be like my final Like let's end this series on a high note type of video because makeup collections are of course my favorite and the last collection I filmed was literally before I went into high school and I'm almost done with high school now So I think it is time for a new makeup collection I'm doing a couple collections I'm going to be doing a MAC makeup collection, ColourPop, blush It'll just kind of be spread out and yeah, hopefully you're okay with that So yeah, let's just dive right in So I guess we'll just be starting out with MAC blushes I have five and these are all of my favorite colors As you can kind of see, there's like a huge color scheme because... A lot of MAC blushes look similar, and I don't want to own so many of the same thing. But yeah, so this right here is Plum Foolery. Wait, yep, Plum Foolery. And it's a copper tone. I love it. It's like a nice purple, and I like it for fall. Then right over here, I have Dame, which is a satin. And honestly, I totally bought this because I used to watch Juicy Star 07, and she said Dame was her favorite color. So I bought Dame. It's super cute. It's like doll face, but a little lighter. And then I have Full of Joy, light color, as you can see, it's like a super light purple. I love this because I like mixing it with other colors, so that's basically why I liked it. And also because I went through a stage where I really wanted well-dressed because MAC Barbie was obsessed with that, but it was too light on my skin tone, which doesn't even make sense because I'm super pale. But yeah, this is like comparable to well-dressed, but I think it's prettier. And then right here, I have Trace Gold, and I just got this... This is my most recent edition, actually. It's super cute. It's because I went through this stage where I really wanted to be um, tan and bronzed. So I bought Trace Gold because I thought it would just make me look bronze and stuff. And I think it's a really pretty color. So yeah, I love it. And then right over here, I have... This is my darkest one. This is Dolly Mix. And I got this because every single time I would go to the MAC store, I thought this was like the prettiest color ever. So yeah, doll face. So, I guess this is just like a culmination of all of my MAC blushes. So, yeah, let's move on to a different category now. Okay, so I guess you could call this my MAC eye products. But as you could see, there's a ton of limited edition packaging. And that's because MAC's limited edition always, always, always gets me. Even though I think that their regular colors are honestly way more prettier. But like, limited edition, so you gotta buy. <laughs> so this is actually the first eyeshadow palette that I ever got. If you wanted to check out my eyeshadow palette collection, you totally should and you totally could. But um, yeah, this, I mentioned this before, this is what, this was like my first um, palette collection. I love it so much and it, ha it just has so many um, amazing memories because I used to go to the Mac store like every Friday with my mom and yeah, it just, it has a lot of good memories. Next, I guess we'll start with my big shadows. This is just a nice blue one, and this is a Marilyn Monroe. I love this because it's super glittery, so I like using that as like an inner corner highlight. So those were my two big ones, and then I just have a ton of um, smaller ones. So these two are limited edition. They're from like the Nocturnals collection or something, and then I just have four right here. These are all my fave colors, so I bought them in these single pots. Not gonna lie, these single pots are like $15 each. Um, definitely not worth it, but if you're a collector of makeup, then it's a good like buy to have. But like just for the average person, I probably wouldn't recommend getting them. But yeah, this one is... let's see. This one is Gleam. This one right here is Swish. It's such a pretty like purpley pink. This one is um, Amber Lights. Oh my god, I love this color. I'm like obsessed with it. And then this one is Motif. And it's such a pretty color. This one isn't as shimmery as the other ones, but nevertheless, it's very pretty. So next, this is like probably the smallest um, of my matte category, but I just have face products. I probably am missing a ton of stuff, but honestly, a lot of MAC stuff I have are samples that came with online orders, and I don't really want to include that because... I just want to talk about like their full size products, but yeah, this is my favorite and only foundation that I own. I used to think I was into liquid foundation, but I quickly arrived at the conclusion that I loved powder because it's so easy and so convenient. I'm in the color C3, and then I just have Max Strobe Cream. This is also like one of the most recent additives to my collection because I love the glowy look and like 
the ethereal sort of look so i just i wanted a strobe cream so i bought a strobe so right here i guess we'll just start with lip products so these are all bare minerals but right here is a mac lip gloss thing that i ever bought it's the mac lip gloss in pink carrot and i thought it was super pretty obsessed with it so i bought this and it just has amazing memories attached to it because i just remember really loving it and then i have my mac lipstick back here oh god i like can't get it out but yeah i bought this for my eighth grade graduation and i never ended up wearing it but it's super cute it's in sunny soul and it's just like a nice corally glittery um peachy pink and i love this gloss uh i mean lip lipstick but i'm not really so much of a lipstick person so i kind of just bought it just because i thought i needed it so yeah and then right here is where a majority of my MAC lip glosses are. My MAC lip glosses. So these are three dazzle glasses. I used to be in this. So these are the three dazzle glasses I have. I used to be in this huge dazzle glass phase. So I bought a ton and I still love them so much. They're my favorite types of MAC um, lip glosses because I think that they're so unique. And a lot of companies don't have lip glosses that are dedicated to being glittery. So yeah. And then right over here, I have um, four that I got in a holiday set. These are kind of like a, you know, a nudie coral theme. These are two glazzle, dazzle glasses and these are two cream sheens. And then right here, I have these and these are all dark lip glosses. And I love them so much. This one's actually my favorite out of all of them. I think it's richly revered. Yep, I'm right. And then, yeah, they're just really pretty. And then right here, this was the first... Um, lip gloss I got before the other one. This is a cream sheen gloss and it's super pretty. It's in the color D light and I got this when I was getting my makeup done. So yeah, this isn't anything Mac, so I'm not going to mention it. And yeah, so basically that was my whole entire Mac collection. I hope you guys liked the video. I hope it was fun to watch because I find these videos entertaining. So I truly hope you guys enjoyed it and yeah, have a good day. Bye guys.